how to print a round full bleed label in custom quick label software. This video will demonstrate how to properly print a round full bleed label using custom quick label software. We will take you through the steps to correctly format your label to successfully print a round label with edge to edge or full bleed printing. When we are done, you will have learned how to format your round label to print with a full bleed. Let's begin by right-clicking our label format and opening the label setup window. We first need to be sure that all of our label setup parameters are accurate. Under the media tab, check to be sure that the correct material type is selected. In sensor type, please check to be sure that it is set to reflective because the round label material has a black mark or reflective mark printed on its liner. The label shape should be set to round. On the size tab, these settings should correspond with the numbers located on the inside of your label roll. Double check these settings with the numbers located on the inside of your roll of labels. If any changes are necessary, you should make them now. Your layout settings should be set to one by one since this is a three inch by three inch label. For margins, we're going to set them all to zero since this is a full bleed label. You can then check whether your label viewing orientation will be portrait or landscape. On your print settings, we will keep our vertical and horizontal overbleed settings at zero until we see how successfully our full bleed label prints out. Click OK and we're now ready to build our label. What is key for a full bleed label is to set the artwork size to be 0.1 inches larger than the physical label. For example, our physical label is a three inch circle. So in order to print full bleed, we will create artwork that is 3.1 inches in diameter. Click on the butterfly icon on the left side of your screen to import your 3.1 inch label artwork. Click on Edit Data Source to locate the image you would like. Center your artwork on the workspace to be sure that it is fully on the label. Now, click on the print icon. We will set our overbleed options to zero because we are not sure if we need to make any changes just yet. Edit your global quantity to the number of labels you would like and then click print. After the test labels are printed, examine them to see where changes must be made. On this label, we see that we must make a vertical and horizontal adjustment for it to have a complete full bleed. We will adjust our horizontal offset, right over bleed, and also the vertical, top bottom settings. Now we will test print again to see whether our changes were successful. As you can see, the changes we made corrected the white outline on the right side of the label, and the color reaches all ends of the label. With an ideal overbleed, you will see a very fine outline of ink on the label liner or backing when the label is removed. Note that a very minimal amount of overbleed onto the liner is desirable. You do not want too much ink on the liner. You have just successfully printed a round label from edge to edge or a full bleed using the Chiaro Inkjet Label Printer.